lot to get to this noon, but this information about the second case is coming from the governor's office that a man who was in Manhattan about two weeks ago is now the second confirmed Omicron case in the U.S. And here's what we can tell you so far. Governor Hochul says that the man was in Manhattan the weekend of November 19th through the 21st. Now, he was attending the Anime NYC 2021 convention that's being held, that was held at the Javits Center on the west side. Now, according to Minnesota health officials, they say he was fully vaccinated and has since recovered. The man started experiencing symptoms on November 22nd and tested positive on November 24th. Again, this information coming from the governor confirming the second case of the Omicron variant in the United States. Now, all of this comes as the Biden administration prepares to release more details about its COVID winter plan to keep Americans safe. The White House sharing a few of those details ahead of the president's address later today, which places a heavy emphasis on vaccinations and testing. Now, these include free rapid home COVID tests, tighter testing requirements, including proof of a negative COVID test 24 hours ahead of anyone entering the United States, regardless of vaccination status or departing country, as well as a huge push on COVID booster shots nationwide as health officials continue to say that vaccines and the boosters are the most effective weapon in the COVID fight. And we're more testing. Also, they're going to be talking a little bit more about that to better track COVID across our country. Our medical team looked at a range of options. We want to make testing more available and more accessible to people across the country. There are four times more tests available now than there were in the summer. We will continue to build on that. Now, the president has said that his plan to fight the virus includes no shutdowns or lockdowns. He's really trying to avoid that. He plans to be relying heavily on science and data. And also, a little more to tell you about our top story. We understand that Minnesota health officials will be holding a news conference this afternoon where we expect to get more information about this new Omicron case, Christy, second in the U.S. so far. We'll keep you up to date and stay on top of this. Back upstairs to you. Antoine, we appreciate it. Thank you very much.